weekend is a long weekend. But why is it long? Because Monday is a holiday. So we don't have any school that Monday. No, because it's Labor Day on Monday. Mom, uh, what is Labor Day? Uh, why do you always have these why and what questions? Okay guys, now we're going to learn about Labor Day. achievement and contributions of American workers. And it comes in the first Monday of September. Labor Day was created by labor movement in the 19th century. And it became a nationwide holiday in 1894. Labor Day also represents the end of summer for many Americans. People celebrate it by doing parties, grilling, and street parades. Labor Day is the third popular day for grilling in the United States. The most popular day is Independence Day, July 4th. And the second popular day is Memorial Day. And the third popular day is Labor Day. Long, long years ago, people used to work a long time for 12 hours, even children, and seven days a week. So then, people started protesting for less working hours. On September 5th, 1882, 10,000 workers took unpaid off to march from City Hall to Union Square in New York, holding the first Labor Day Parade in U.S. history. Then it became a law that people have to have eight hours labor, eight hours recreation, and eight hours rest. Is that real? Of course it is. Hmm, do you know who's the founder of Labor Day? Oh, some people believe it is Peter Mayfair, but many people believe it is Matthew Mayfair. The first Labor Day was celebrating on September 5th. Oh, now you forgot the day and the year. It's Tuesday, September 5th, 1882. Oh. President Gover Cleveland signed a law that every first Monday of September should be Labor Day. 